Next question is from Fredrickson855. What do you guys think about complexes when it comes to building muscle? So now let me get this straight. I'm going to ask you, Justin, because yeah. this is kind of like a performance thing. It is. It, 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 now, how many exercises constitutes it a complex? constitutes a complex? Yeah, that's a good question. I I would say three, but I mean, I, I could be wrong. Um, I mean, look it up, Doug. Yeah, look it know. up. Cause it, yeah, because then it becomes circuit training. Because then we, right? just, we just basically stack uh, some of these exercises together to make the, make the uh, overall exercise more difficult, obviously. So it's like you're basically supersetting, but it's – Usually in a way where you have a like one, uh, you either have a barbell, you have dumbbells, you have kettlebells. There's different ways you can do it, but it's not like you're replacing it. You're trying to use the same equipment uh, to pull off these moves, and usually starts with like deadlift, goes into squat, goes into an overhead press, goes into a backloaded squat, uh, and then they, there's kind of creative variations from there. Yeah, I feel like this is uh, not feel like I, I the benefit of this really is about strength stamina strength endurance yeah it's like work capacity Do, exactly yeah but even better uh way to say it does this contribute to muscle building not directly i don't think it directly it's a great way to build muscle however if you improve your work capacity and your capacity to handle higher reps and move from exercise to exercise could that contribute to building more muscle when you do more traditional type lifting i'd say yes i mean i think Intermittently using this as a tool, sure, I like it. Uh, for using that as your 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 way of training most of the time, terrible idea. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's if, it, but if building muscle is your goal, right? Yeah, if building muscle or strength, building muscle or strength, it, you're going to be better off with straight sets and long rest periods and one lift. Yeah. Just fl plain and simple. All the research supports that. Does that not mean that you get some benefits from running a complex, a circuit, a superset, a triset, all these different ways of right. combining exercises in a routine? Yeah, there's value to it, but the more and more you keep adding to that, you 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 start to sway over to work capacity, right. endurance, stamina, and that becoming the major adaptation and not building strength and muscle as the number one right. adaptation. Yeah, you know what's funny is that at, Doug's been pulling up articles on complexes and this is what i this is what i thought that's why i wanted to um you know just confirm the word complex in our space has been used to replace circuit because circuit sounds like uh you like know it sounds like aerobic class yeah, aer aerobics yeah. it doesn't sound tough right so what they're doing now is calling it <laughs> it works on me yeah, <laughs> it, it, uh, yeah I'm like yeah. like oh complex is totally different yeah i'm not going to yeah, do yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. no cuz like he pulled up an article here's a here's a nine exercise barbell complex right it sounds better than a nine exercise barbell circuit cuz yeah. it's circuit, circuit training yeah. Yeah. that's why i think yeah, it's I'm crap out. it's yeah. crap for the most part intermittently using it you are short on time one day and you want to do a cool complex yeah. to get your workout in oh, 20 yeah. minutes Sure, do it. Or Otherwise, do something with kettlebell outside. You know, it's just good to change it up. But yeah, it's totally a novelty. So this is like a novelty workout that you can do every occasionally and and get some benefit from it. But yeah, it's not something you want well, to stick with. This is what uh, CrossFit calls it all the time, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, I got this new barbell complex I'm doing that's super yeah. cool. Yeah, it's like part of their lingo. That's yeah, where yeah. it came from. Because otherwise, we would just call it no, shitty circuit training. Yeah. <laughs> that's, what, that's what we called it two training. decades ago. They stole shit, yeah. everything just doing some shitty circuit training. That's what we're doing. trainers. Yes, yeah. thank you. I, the most exercises I think you should combine for, for... Now, forget performance, stamina, work capacity. I think you could put together complexes, but they have to be programmed really well. It's rare that I see a really well-programmed combination of four or more exercises but let's just say your goal is to build muscle the most exercises you probably should combine are two i think a superset you can do that past that it starts to really tap into that cardio component where it becomes very very much about endurance yeah unless that's the goal is like yeah is durability yes and, and you know that's part of the adaptation you're seeking like it's you know it's one of those other tools you can pull out and and go for it and by the way if you're if you're listening and i know i just shit all over complexes and maybe that's the way you train all the time if you're consistent with it you love doing it you're good at your form and technique and it's what keeps you coming back and training all the time like okay that's got value to it mm -hmm. because you like doing it and you have fun with it then by all means go ahead and keep it but if you're going to get a question like this where you ask me straight up is it good for building building muscle or building strength compared to straight sets no no, no. no. yeah 